Hey YouTube! So I am on my way to go get some plant mail. I'm a little nervous. Uh, so I think I mentioned in a previous video that I had purchased a plant from Thailand. There is a website called New Life Tropicals where they have the most gorgeous Sansevierias that you can find and I ordered it on Christmas and it is February 16th and it has finally arrived but as you can see maybe behind me our ground is covered in snow it's cold so that's the reason why I'm so nervous is it might not be alive so let's go find it um, I got a slip on my door yesterday that said that it had arrived and I could go to my local post office and pick it up. However, I don't have a local post office, so finding it might take a while. Alright guys, so here is my plant. Um, as you can see there, uh, it shows how much I paid for it, $24, and that was with shipping. So let's see if I can open this up here. Here is my Fido Sanitary Certificate. It came in a shoebox styled box. It was more certificate paperwork has my address on it, so I'm not going to show the whole thing here. I think it's wrapped well. Got it tagged here. And this is a bare root plant. So it's not gonna be any soil. Oh wow. I would say this looks pretty good, guys. I'm very happy with the condition of this plant. Now I just need to find a pot for it. Okay guys, so I've made it back home and I have placed my whale fin, Sansevieria, into a jar of water so that the roots can kind of, I don't know, readapt to the climate that it's going to be living in. And um, I think I've noticed one thing about this plant and I'll show you right here. Not that there's anything wrong with it at all. This is a perfect plant. The roots have been cut off of a much larger plant, which is totally fine, but it just makes me wonder how large, you know, these are small plants, but I'm just wondering how large the mother plant was that these little guys came off of. And there's actually three leaves that I did receive. So there's this one here, there's this one here, and there's a tiny, here we go. There's a tiny baby leaf right there. So that's really cool. So again, guys, these came from New Life Tropicals. 
I am gonna go ahead and jump over and show you how easy it is to navigate their website. Buying plants from this particular website is a little different than normal websites because the process is you pick out what you want and I didn't realize this but like I'm moving through the pages wanting to like check out to see how much shipping was gonna be before you know like I would actually commit to anything and that's not how they do things they um, it, you move through the pages and then all of a sudden it's like thanks for your purchase we'll send you an invoice so um, it took a while for them to send me an invoice because of because of the holiday season which you know I, I I really didn't know what to expect and that's perfectly fine that the way that it worked out I'm I'm happy with my plants in fact at the time we were in the middle of a government shutdown when they were preparing to ship these plants out and they emailed me and they said hey we're gonna hold off on shipping you these plants because of the plant shipping stations for customs over there. Like, either nobody was there to work them or they were short on workers. And they said that the lines would be too long and um, stressful on the plants for them to successfully make it over here in a reasonable amount of time. So they held off for about a, a good month, month and a half before my plants even shipped out. So um, I, like I said, I didn't know what to expect. Um, I wasn't even sure that I was going to get my plants because I had no experience. There wasn't a whole lot of information on the internet about this website. But again, I'm so happy that I have these because you can't find them in the Midwest. And I'll show you guys the planner that I got. I think uh, this is kind of just how I will plant them in there like that. I think that'll be really cute. I got this at um, Pure One Imports. They currently have a clearance on these right now for like $7.98 or something like that. Really cute. I wish they had other animals. Um, I probably would have picked up more just because they're so adorable. There isn't a drainage hole, but given the fact that this is a Sansevieria and I have no intentions of overwatering it, it'll be just fine. All right. Let's hop over to New Life Tropicals. All right, so here we are on newlifetropicals.com. It is a website that is secure. See the HTTPS? That's a good indication that it was a secure website. This is the home landing page. If we scroll down here, it breaks down into different categories. Um, philodendrons, monsteras, um, sansevarias, alocasias. There's different um, caudix and succulent plants, aglonemias. Um, let's see here. Different bulbs and ferns. In some other categories, they don't have a ton of different varieties, but look at this fern, guys. This reminds me of the Hoya rope. Uh, the Philodendron Monstera section is kind of one of my favorite sections to look at. Even though I would be a little bit nervous having some of these plants shipped so far away. I've, I've seen where other people like on Reddit haven't had a problem. But if you look at some of the prices of these plants, that's really not affordable for me. 
Here is the Philodendron Pink Princess for $38. So if we go back on the Sansevieria page, my favorite plant, and I think I'm just going to go ahead and order some of these plants here. This is a plant that I've been wanting. This plant retails for $21 at my local greenhouse, and I don't even think they have any more left in stock. So one plant, $10. One other plant that I really want is the Sansevieria Samurai. I also want this here too. They have a, a variegated variety for $75. Lots of different varieties that I've never seen before. These plants are pretty, but still, I, these plants just look like they're enormous. I wish it listed how large these plants get because from the photographs they look enormous. This is the plant that I ordered, the Congo cow's tongue, the Sansevieria masononian. I did not say that right. Let's see here, what else? I also like the Sansevieria rordas. Lots of variegated Sansevierias. There's a solid gold Hanini. It's really pretty. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get the, ooh, I like this one too, but I think I'm gonna stick to my plan. My plan was to pick out the Sansevieria, the starfish plant, and then the Sansevieria samurai. If I can find it again here. Fold specimen with a few fat spine tip leaves arranged in a fan, eventually becoming very large. This is the plant that I wanted. Okay, so I'm going to add this to the cart. So my subtotal is $24. Okay, so yeah, that's that's all I'm going to get um, for today. Okay, so since I am signed in, um, I'm going to go ahead and review my order. And that's what I picked out. I'm going to hit the next button. I'm blocking out this section because of my personal information. And then you just hit the place order. And it says, thank you for your order. We'll email you an order confirmation with details and shipping price suddenly as we can. So that's it. They'll email me with my total, which will then include shipping. Shipping um, last time was approximately $18. I'm assuming it'll be about the same. And that's it, guys. Thanks for checking out my purchase from Thailand. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I will see you later.